वेलकम बैक री एनफोर्समेंट लर्निंग दिस सेशन आई एक्सप्लेन दूसिंग डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन क्यू लर्निंग टू प्ले फ्री वे गेम ओके यूजिंग डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन क्यू लर्निंग टू प्ले फ्री वे गेम इयर डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन क्यू लर्निंग इज डिफरेंट विथ द ट्रेडिशनल क्यू लर्निंग द ट्रेडिशनल क्यू लर्निंग ट्रीट द फुल प्रॉली डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ एक्शन वैल्यूज इंस्टेड ऑफ सिंगल एक्सपेक्टेड वैल्यूज traditional expect traditional uh, q learning expect the single values the distributional q learning expect the distributional values so this model uh, enable the agent to consider the variability and uncertainty in action outcomes and it also solve the risk sensitivity decision making and in this context in the free way game we use the distributional deep q network to train an agent to play the atari game free way so we in this session we see the distributed q learning concept to apply the atari game uh, to perform well how to it perform the distributional q learning it produce the distributional uh, probability values for the rewards in a state action pair so advantage is improve the performance better generalization and ability to utilize the risk sensitivity policies compared with the traditional systems the environment setup Uh, we have we get the environment of the uh, free way game a uh, free atari free way atari game uh, we got using open ai gym the free way environment is accessed through the open ai gym library which provides the standardization interface for various reinforcement learning environments the state representation the state is pre processed and converted into pytorch tensor normalize the to ensure that the gradient sizes remain manageable so it is a, a free way game environment uh, no operation up and down uh, this is the live screenshot uh, for the free way game uh, now the implementation steps we are initialize the hyper parameters okay set the uh, neural network neural network hyper parameters set the necessary hyper parameters such as the learning rate discount factor replay size and epsilon values for the epsilon greedy policy in exploration exploitation point of view and action space define the action space for the freeway environment what are the actions okay mention uh, we also define the actions for the game and uh, next uh, this is the implementation steps for the uh, hyper parameter initialization and action space the we are the initialize the all parameter values next uh, state pre processing we apply the state pre processing state are normalized to have the values between 0 and 1 which stabilize the gradient during the training so we are apply the normalize the state values next one is the action selection the policy select the action based on expected value of the predicted action value distribution so expected values are computed as the inner product of the distribution support and its probabilities so the next step is action selection okay action selection steps and experience replay with prioritization so to accelerate the learning the replay buffer prioritize the rare but significantly uh, experiences so experiences means winning or losing states okay that is the experience this help the agent focus on learning impactful game dynamics so the replay buffer prioritize the uh, uh, prioritize the model to move to the winning side okay winning side and hyper parameters and uh, set up the environment freeway ram uh, v0 and open ai gym support range values between minus 10 to plus 10 with 51 discrete, uh, discrete steps and epsilon greedy strategy decreasing the epsilon over apex to balance the exploration and exploitation and replay buffer fixed size dq double ended q with prioritized replay for rare events and this is the code for the training the distributed dq on freeway we apply the environment uh, Uh, action space is the three uh, value minimum and maximum minus 10 plus 10 number of support values 51 and support uh, we are apply this code with learning rate gamma epsilon and prioritize level and update frequencies of the target network we are we are defined in uh, training stage so implementation steps such a main training loop we have the action selection environment interaction 
reward adjustment in uh, experience replay, gradient descent, target network updates, and epsilon decay. These are the steps we are using, we are applied in uh, freeway game with, with the distributed DQN. Action selection choose either random action or one based on their policy. In environment interaction, take an action, receive the next state on reward, that is the interaction. Reward adjustment, encode game specific rewards. Uh, plus 10 for crossing or minus 10 for losing, minus 1 for con continuing. Experience replay, st store transition to the replay buffer, duplicating priority experiences. And gradient descent, update the distributed DQN parameters using the Bellman laws. Target network updates, pri periodically synchronize the target network with the main uh, network and epsilon decay gradually reduce the exploration. Okay, these are the main steps uh, we are we are performed in main training loop. And this is the code and implementation in training. The loss is reduced even if the uh, epoxy is increased, the loss is reduced. The last part for training distributed you can on the Atari game prevail. The loss gradually decreases, dec declines, but uh, has significant spikes due to the prioritized target network update. These spikes are happen uh, period periodically target network updates are synchronization. Okay, the loss is reduced uh, if the epochs are increased, the loss also reduced uh, gradually. So, implementation steps, observation steps in implementation, reward distribution, loss dynamics, action value distribution and performance. So, the reward distribution, the agent successfully learn to prioritize the actions that lead to a plus 10 reward, best reward. Loss dynamics, the loss declines for the epochs, but exhibits the spikes due to the target network updates only. The action value distribution, the hub action, bimodal distribution with the peaks minus 1 and plus 10 guides the agent effectively and performance. Achieving the four or more successful crossing for epochs indicates a well-trained model. It's a well-trained model. After 400 epochs, we got the well, good loss. Uh, so, the distributed DQN is uh, the very suitable to solve the complex environments in reinforcement learning. Uh, we have already seen with uh, um, freeway Atari game. Thank you.